Hey, savvy performers, Sean Royer here, talent development specialist in Los Angeles, California. I help singers and actors achieve their show business dreams every day, online and in my Los Angeles studio. And today I'm gonna to talk about how to launch your career in three easy steps. Step one is to create a great product. As a show business person, you are your product. So you need to work on your craft. Have you worked on your branding? Have you worked on your actual singing or your acting? Are you taking classes? Are you improving every day? A lot of times we feel like we've gotten to a certain point and we don't need to practice again and we don't need to get better, but actually everyone does. And I'll tell you, some of the best performers I've ever worked with, like Jennifer Lopez, Selena Gomez, Demi Lovato, Justin Timberlake, they work on their craft consistently. They know that they're their product, so they keep it in tip-top shape. So please remember, if you're gonna have a great career in show business, the first step is to create a good product. Step number two is put out good content. So of course, if you have a good product, you wanna showcase that product in the best possible way. So that means go ahead and take time and plan what you're doing, whether it's a song, whether it's a scene, or whether you're hosting a vlog, you need to make sure that you take your time and plan your content and make it good because that's a representation of you. And the better it is, the more your fans and the industry will respect you. The third step to launching your show business career is to find your audience. Now, a lot of us want to be world dominators. We want everyone to be our audience, but that's not what you do at first. You find the smallest audience you can and you cater to them. Focus on that audience. So for example, if you're a singer, right, instead of trying to promote to pop, right, maybe you promote to singer-songwriter pop from Nashville or singer-songwriter pop from Florida. The longer your long tail keyword is, the more likely you're able to be found in searches. Once you find your smaller niche or niche, I don't know which one it is, tomato, tomato, right, you will be able to expand that. So for example, let's take Selena Gomez, right? Her audience was really at that time seven-year-old to nine-year-old girls. But as she got more popular in that, then their brothers and sisters and their mothers and dads began to follow. Find your very small niche and it will expand. But don't try at first to get everyone. Take it small, take it slow. Well, I hope you found this advice helpful. I'm Sean Royer, Talent Development Specialist. Please remember my motto, when you count the stars, I hope you count yourself first.